Hi guys, welcome to the Spoon Fed Med, where we'll discuss the most high yielding medical concepts in less than 5 minutes in a super concise and interesting way. Let's dive right into it. We know the old anti-inginal drugs are the nitrates, the beta blockers, calcium blockers and the potassium openers. However, in the exams, we are mainly asked the new anti-inginal drugs. First is the Eva Braden. A brad is trying to be funny, hence its inhibitor of the funny current in the essay node. It decreases the heart rate as well as the oxygen required by the heart. Next, we have the Fasu Dil. Dil is a heart and here it is broken, hence it is crying and Ro means cry in Hindi, hence it's a Ro kinase inhibitor. It's used in the coronary spasm. Next, we have the Trimetazidin. We know alphabetically Z lies close to the X, alphabet X. Hence, it's a PFOX inhibitor. It inhibits the fatty, ac fatty acid oxidation in the heart. Thereby, it decreases the oxygen required by the heart. Hence, used in angina. Next, we have the Nicorandil. I and C in Nico lie very close. And hence, we can remember it as resembling to K. Hence, it is a potassium ATP channel agonist. What's important is to remember it's an agonist and not an antagonist. Last one is the ranolazin. Remember, in the drug itself, we have the word lazy. Hence, it's lazy. Therefore, it's always late. Hence, it is a late sodium channel blocker. It also decreases the intracellular calcium in the heart, thereby the contractility or the workload of the heart is decreased. So that's all for today. Thank you.